Hello, people! My name is Rage, and welcome and all to Isaac After Above Seed of the Week. And I have got good news, everyone! I've made some new friends. This one is called Tommy. This one is Fred. He's playing with Dave. We have Harry, Harold, Henry, and Homan. <laughs> Hey, Bray, can you give me a quick rattle-off list of uh, human names? And that'd be pretty good. Then we could do this whole, like, fairy thing. That'd be really, really cool. Sure thing, Mouth. Sure thing. I'll just do that. <laughs> Homan. Homan. Wait, wait a minute. <laughs> Stop sniggering at me. I probably shouldn't be the kind of person that has an argument with, with their own brain. It probably doesn't lead to... Oh, my God. God, there is so many of them. What actually are they? I've never really... Ooh, that is a quality first item. I will accept that. But what actually are they? I've never really thought about it. I mean, logic would dictate that they're fireflies, right? But they're the wrong color, so... Perhaps they are fairies, but they're not telling me to pay attention to them, so maybe not. I mean, they go cool. devil deal, looking good, and then I'm about to be laughed out of the room. Calm down, Wallmaster. Calm the down, and that is Judas's shadow. I didn't actually properly notice what it was because of the curse of darkness, so I think we will definitely take that. That seems like a good idea. I mean, it could be just like general magic residue in the air. I feel like I'm noticing them a lot more for like the first time here and I know there's a tinted rock there but apparently I have to ignore it as much as it pains me to do so <laughs> I feel like I've not really noticed them as much surely I have right because they are everywhere in in dark floors are they everywhere in dark floors because they're not in this room is it rooms that don't have enemies in so that would mean that they are living, because we can kind of get an idea for their ecology here then. All right, this, we're making some progress. So if we go back in here and then back in here, oh no, they've not moved in, but maybe, oh, tears up, that is very, very good. So there's flies in the rooms that don't, yeah, look, it's consistent. So they must be alive then, because that would mean that they know about the death everything in the rooms with enemies in, and they don't want to get obviously eaten and destroyed. So in theory, oh no, no, this completely, completely removed any and all hypothesis from everything that I was talking about there. Error, error, error. <laughs> such a perfect time for my voice to do whatever the fuck my voice just decided it wanted to do there. Lovely. I have to see. That's probably a good thing. Many punches. You're welcome, Nancy Rhino. So, you know, whenever you see a really pathetic, cowardly rhino get into a fight with a boxer, you can, you can tell him he's happy for his many punches. Many, many punches. Many, many punches. Uh, Okay, let's face Ragman. This should be fairly easy. Now, I'm not deliberately dying and getting tinted rocks and stuff for Juice's shadow because, uh, once again, I am uh, submitting to the will of the seed submitter. And talking of the seed submitter, he's a heavy hitter who ain't no quitter because he submitted a document of such great might that I could not help but fight through the floors to see if the seed that he submitted is the one that is going to be submitted for the show in which I will submit it for the submit. I'm not skilled enough at rapping to make the same word rhyme with each other. I mean, granted, nobody is technically skilled enough to make the same word rhyme with each other because that's not how it works, and that's like saying, oh, I'm not a good enough scientist to break gravity. Oh, life is hard. But I do mean in the kind of general sense that uh, what I wanted to do there was the kind of technique where you make it so that the word before the end word rhymes. So, for example, if I was going to talk about a hat... And then I wanted both sentences to end in a hat. I would go, yo, my hat is... No, 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 I wouldn't. I wouldn't say hat there. No, I'd be like, yo, brown is the color of my hat. So don't even attempt to try hat. I meant like... Like, try to steal it, but I, I realized I ran out of words. And, and the point is, the word before the end word, okay, is what decides whether it rhymes or not. You know, the, the word with the... <sighs> Look, I just... Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I don't even want anything. 
I don't want anything to do with this. No, I do not. Wait a minute. Alrighty then, I return after a jump cut most sudden. Basically, I may have had a case of uh, completely misreading the instructions and it was supposed to be normal mode instead of hard mode, so we weren't actually going to get the correct scene. But it's a good job I realized before I'd done like eight floors, okay? That's the advantage that we need to realize here. Free spirit room, fr free spirit room from a heart is really free. What is up with my brain today? I swear I've got like an error going on. I swear I am glitchy. <laughs> yes. You lovely, lovely, glorious, happy being. A quad shot with magic mushroom and a hopefully eventually due to shadow, assuming it's not just a there in case we die item. This is good. Uh, this is very good because obviously in Seed of the Week when you get quad shot that tends to mean that goodness is coming and I'll admit when goodness is coming I tend to be happy about that. that. That wasn't really like a revelation or anything. I feel like most people tend to enjoy it when you know good things occur. So again apparently I need to ignore Tinted Rocks for now. I'm, I'm not entirely sure for the reason but I, I guess we will uh, find out. Little Horn, prepare to meet your maker! Yes, uh, Ian, indeed. See that one? Uh, no, no, actually, no, it's fine. What? What? It's fine. It's fine. I was gonna, I was gonna analyze, prepare to meet your maker, but then I realized, actually, no, I, I get it. I do. I do completely and utterly get it. I was hoping. I was very, very much hoping, and then we can kill ourselves, and then, oh, look at us, we look terrifying, that is actually really cool, and we can grab ourselves the dog food, and then we, we need, we, 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 we kind of, we kind of want a bomb of, of some description, can I, can I get one of them bombs, please, no, 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 no bombs there, well, I mean, we don't, we don't need bombs, you know, bombs are obviously f for lame people who who need explosives to compensate for their crippling, crippling loneliness because everybody knows that a bomb isn't just for Christmas, you know, you have to nurture it until it explodes one day. Okay, on to the third floor, we want, careful. That room seems surprisingly easy, almost suspiciously easy. That, however, is very, very useful. An extra free spirit heart. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> I love Brimstone. I mean, it is just so glorious, isn't it? It's gotta just be one of the best, if not the best synergies in the entire game. And by synergies, I mean items in general. I don't know what's up with my head. I'm really all over the place today. I really, really am. Like, I don't even remember being asleep. And that might need some context, but I don't. I, like, I went to sleep last night, and then I woke up this morning, and it happened instantly. This is gonna sound like I'm just describing actual sleep, but normally you kind of get a feel for the period of time that you were asleep, whereas for me, it just, oh, two free spirit hearts, that's great. It just kind of felt like I lied in bed awake, and then somebody compressed eight hours into half an hour with some, like, editing magic. And then I just kind of got up again. It's it's a really weird sensation to describe. I think it's because a lot of alarms went off and I woke up at, at, at bits. And I also heard meowing at some point, which normally would have been a sign that... Yeah. <laughs> oh, yes! As soon as you see Quad Shot Brimstone, you hope. You hope and you pray for that sweet, sweet uh, bouncing action. Shame I can't get those tears, but I guess we will murder you. Yes, we will. And I heard some meowing, which obviously re-roll. Yes, look at that. Extra pair of horns. I mean, not looking as good since we got bouncing tears, but still completely fine. Oh, God, there are so many directions this can go in. I just can't keep track of it all. I just can't keep track of all the directions. So I heard meowing, which, as I said, normally would mean that I'm just going crazy. But in this instance, it's because, obviously, there is now a kitten in the house. Uh, and I never know in my sleep whether things are happening or not. So 
what I did because I <laughs> what I what I did because I heard meowing is I had this sort of sleepy fevered dream that oh my god the cat's going to escape and uh, I effectively felt the need, because basically in my room there's two windows, as, you know, there tends to be windows in most people's room. And then, apart from apart from the slaves, of course, I mean, they, they don't need windows, like, seriously. I mean, they're not even going to be alive long enough for it to matter. We I mean, may as well cut costs some way. You know, you got you got to think about your expenses if you're going to run a successful a successful slavery. I mean, I mean, come on now, this is not my first rodeo. But most people, windows, bedroom, yeah. And, uh, like, we have, like, full length windows and uh, you can like go onto a little ledge and then they're a little bit higher so basically perfect cat jumping out of window height hence the worry hence always having to make sure that they are indeed uh, a thing re-roll re-roll re re-roll okay re-roll some more re-roll a further time okay just keep re-rolling and we're out of money how did that even happen? I mean, it's because I spent it. Oh, and then we just get teased with this. Are you crazy right now, game? You knavish knave. But yeah, I just think I'm really tired. And that's why my brain is just kind of like, nah, 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 we're not giving you. I mean, freaking Homan. Oh, Homan. Oh, I'm still thinking about that. It's like, seriously? Like, if you were introducing a friend who you'd forgotten his name, you're not going to grasp a Homan, oh, are you? I mean, there are better, likely, probable freaking things. I'll go and some extra money. Oh. God, apparently I need to re-roll that until I get one of my favorite items in the game, which, which while I like as cryptic instructions, does tend to be vague. So yeah, I hear meowing, my door is closed, so there is no way that the cat can be in the room, and also it's like 7 o'clock, so it's, it's still locked in his room, which obviously is next door, hence why I heard it, but daddy's still asleep and everything, and I have one of these moments where your eyes snap open, and fear grips your soul, and your heart starts beating incredibly quickly, and, and it kind of, it almost hurts, I don't, don't, don't tell me you've not had that. You've had that. All right, shut up. And I basically launched myself. And I don't use it like an expression, like I moved quickly. No, I mean I launched myself. Grabbing hold of the covers, kind of like sat up really, really fast. Or kind of sprung into a sort of crouching, leaping position. And then sprang off like a frog. <laughs> holding the covers and leapt towards the window. Now, at this point, I've obviously taken all the covers with me, so I then hear a, what the fuck are you doing from Danny, who is, you know, rudely awakened by my frog impression at seven in the morning. <laughs> And the sudden ripping away of, you know, her warmth. Ooh, that's a lot of battery action. Kind of like that. Yes, I do. All right, back to the item room for all of us. And I land on the floor, and then I just start scrambling like a lizard to the windowsill. And I'm like, wait, wait, wait a minute. There's no, there's no, uh... Oh, what? It went invisible again. Hey! There we go! Lovely. Hey, wait, did I just say, wait, it went invisible again? Instead of, wait, the donation machine exploded. What is wrong with me today? I'm so confused. Okay, alright, hitting myself in the face was not a good idea. So I'm scrambling up, and I get to the windowsill, and I, I see that the windows are closed, and, and I don't see a cat, and I'm like, what? I don't understand what, what happened. Where's, where's the danger? Where, where's, where's the danger? And then I just hear from behind me, Get back in bed, you moron. And I'm like, I don't, but I was trying to save the, uh, sure you were, sure you were. No, I was, I thought he was good, and then, I don't understand. Ooh, that's convenient. And finally some bombs, which is obviously lovely. So, yeah, I had that scared the hell out of me because the brimstone instantly fired. So I was like, what the hell is happening to this room? But no, it was just a, a brimstone spray everywhere. So I had such a terrifying moment. I, I thought I was seconds away from being that guy that let the cat jump out the window and escape. <laughs> just... Even though there was no conceivable way for it to happen, it just, ah, oh my god, 
I just don't know. So from that point onwards, I was just like adrenaline pumping trying to get back to sleep. And obviously, that doesn't go terrifically well in uh, most circles. So here we are in a delirious day, recording scene of the week when my brain can barely function. Reroll! And okay, I guess we basically just upgraded to uh, the better version of that item there. We'll go into uh, the secret room. Hey! A nice little bit of... Uh, tears up there. In fact, isn't that, yeah, I was just going to say, isn't that the fun guy transformation, which looks uh, really cool with his hair, because the mushroom just looks like a very chill hat. What are you? I found peels. And then we got ourselves some strength. And yes, we do. Oh, I like some strength. It's the best kind of strength that we know. Yet we know. All right, down here. Murderize all of them. Grab a load of money from that, of course, tactical damage. I mean, considering all of my failings, which is obviously a lot. Spider mod, don't really care. We'll kill the boss, so oh, it's monstro too. God, we are doing so much damage. We really are. Although we did just get some extra, huh. Okay, Guppy's head, not really a big deal. We did just get some extra moolah, so I guess I could get spider mod, and that might be okay, but I'm not sure. And then I guess we'll go to the super secret room. Ooh, what did this come from? Rules card. That suddenly a lot of re-rolling occur occurring there. That is a distinctly large amount of it. I feel like I might just... Oh, yeah, I went over there for the super secret room and then immediately forgot about it. My memory is just... Like, the amount of times recently I've walked into a room, forgot what I'm doing, and turned around and walked out of it. It's just... It's it's just... It's not even funny. Well, I mean, it's funny for people who are... <gasps> okay, we're all right. We're all right. We're okay. Nobody panic. Nobody panic. It's funny for the people that are seeing this happen to me because it's like, haha, you're losing your mind. But for me, it's like scary, you know? I just... I just don't understand, but what I do understand is this is shaping up to be a stellar, stellar, Ella, Ella seed of the week. I mean, obviously, immediately, quad shot bouncing brimstone is just dope. It really is. And um, yes, I just used dope in a sentence unironically. What are you gonna do about it? Fight my gang squad? Yeah, I didn't think so. Stars? I mean, it's not really necessary. We have 12 cards and it saves coming back for the double active. Kill that guy. Kill him dead. We ain't having no psychic hairballs around this part of town. And... Ouija board, yeah! All right, well, I guess I will re-roll you and regret my decision instantly. Nice. A couple more keys, that's fine. Get the secret room. Do I want the health up? Do I want, do I, do I, do I want the health up? Probably not, because I imagine I want some Polaroid invincibility eventually in this run. The annoying thing about this transformation, especially now we've lost our hair. I mean, the hair's actually nothing to do with it, but damn it, we've lost our hair! But no, the annoying thing is I really, really want to be able to tell when my brimstone is charged. That tends to be helpful. Okay, yeah, we could just do that, and then we have that, and then all should be well with the world. Although I do need a teleport out of the boss rush, so I guess technically I should just use this. This this works, right? I, I, I think. Like, let's, let's go kill Mother, and then we'll see, because we need to go to boss rush. And brrr, instant destruction there. I am liking that. And then we'll grab the Polaroid, have a quick dabble in here. And uh, nothing really too uh, crazy. And then finally, uh, the boss room. And uh, apparently I'm going to be very happy when I re-roll here. And there is one particular item I'm very much hoping for. So fingers crossed. Ha <laughs> ha, yes. There is nothing wrong with some good old classic quad shot bouncing maximum damage brimstone that also is homing. I say classic, it's still a convoluted synergy, but we're not done yet. Apparently there is uh, more instructions, so I'm excited to see how that is uh, going to go down, but yeah.
Oh, man. Just look at this go. Because obviously there's just nothing they can do about it. It's just absolutely melting everything. I'll, I'll grab that real quick. That's fine. Is it just me? Oh, yeah, there we go. He's got to pop out of the ground in order to be meltified. Uh, goodbye, Carrion Queen. You tried your best. And then the wretched. And I can't even get to their corpse fast enough. It's like, seriously, what kind of whack shop am I running here that I can't even see the corpses explode in blood? That's like half the point of playing this game. Ah. <sighs> Okay, I've got quite a mess on the floor. I'd hate to be the janitor that has to clean up the boss rush. Can you imagine having to come in after this and be like, Oh my god, there's so many parts of creatures on the floor and blood everywhere. L like, seriously, re-roll! <laughs> yes! Let's make it a six-shot spread. That seems pretty good. Alright then, so... Apparently, I need to leave and then acquire a charge of d6 and then go back to. Then go back. We have to go back! And then go back to the devil deal? I, I, I believe. I mean, I'm not entirely sure how this is going to work, because it's not like it's just going to reappear for us. So, I I'm, I'm feel like the... Ow! That was, of course, tactical. I feel like the instructions aren't completely complete here. Curving that battery is obviously at least useful, but I guess we'll see what happens. It, it might suddenly spring back to life and, and be there, right? Totally, 100% and and it, it, it is not, no, no it's not, I mean I wasn't really expecting it to, so I'm not really rightly sure, but that's fine, you know, I don't mind it, and da 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 they're actually quite good dancers, Arisa Killian's thinking about it. They do, they do a pretty good job. We'll go in that. I don't, alright, don't. You don't need to wonder. No! 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 Why? Why would you? Why would you do? Why would you do this? Why? Why would you do this? Give me some keys! Give me my keys back, you bastards! Give me my keys back! I don't deserve this. You know, I, I don't deserve this. I just, I just wanted items for the, yes, all right, that's, that's a single key. That's fine. That's a key that we can work with here. I'm losing a lot of health doing this. I will fully admit that I, I made a mistake. And stop giving me bombs. Stop rubbing it in. Why? Why do you do this? I, I just, what have I done? Why do I need this to happen? Oh my god, there's just so many bombs. I mean, at least doing these trap rooms don't matter, because they're just going to instantly get annihilated each time we do a thing, but... Yes, oh thank god. Oh thank god. I am no longer a moron, because I have a feeling... Did I, did I know what that pill was? I have a feeling I knew what that pill was. Yes, okay, good. Good, recovery. We're recovering, guys. The recovery is, is in place. This is... This is okay. We've we've got enough we've got enough keys now. This is this is fine. <laughs> I can't believe that happened though. I seriously cannot believe that happened. Well, we obviously don't need the world, so that is fine. We'll check our secret room, see what's going on. Lot of health. Don't really care. Hey, Mama Goody. I actually thought she was gonna survive that for a second. Sinfoil. Don't mind if I do. Do not mind if I do. Then I will uh, grab that, and that should be all okay. I don't know whether this is hushable, because I need my keys uh, on the chest, obviously. So I guess it, it basically, it comes down to key amount again, and I, I can't rely on getting keys on the cathedral. Reroll! Hey! A little bit of flight. That will do nicely. Good old transcendence. We are now ahead of the game! Because <laughs> I 
Luke is like really ahead of the ahead of the game, ahead of the game, because <laughs> ahead of the game. I really get too much enjoyment out of this, don't I? That's 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 something I gotta work on. I really is my therapist. My therapist does say I can't get better unless I let the puns go, but I, I can't, I can't let them go. They're part of my core being. They are my core memories and my core personality chips. I don't have anger, sadness, joy, etc. I just have puns. It's all I got. It's not much, but it's mine. It's not much, but it's mine. I don't want to go in the double key room. I also, I guess I should explore a little bit more, because why the hell not? Come on, pop up. This is fine. Hey, a couple extra keys. What is going on in here? Again, not really that much. I guess we can probably hush it up now, right? Well, we'll get some replacement keys from the shop and the like, so potentially this is fine. Also, that is just ridiculous. So many being just annihilated. And now we do actually get to have our invincibility shield and Leviathan. Oh my god, how good does that look? Look, it looks like two perfectly grown flicks of a mustache. Oh, that is really good. You are styling, Isaac. You are styling. <laughs> that is wonderful. Oh, he's got it going on. He has got it going on. We'll buy that. There we go. That should be fine. Nothing crazy in there. And I guess we want to re-roll the right one. Because, you know, we won't want to re-roll the wrong one. <laughs> uh, 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 uh. Okay. And boom. I guess we'll get Rotten Baby. Why the hell not? So, I see now why there was no mention of the hush floor. Because this, I'll admit, is some very, very paltry offerings. But, you know, Sissy Long Legs. Everyone likes Sissy Long Legs. And, let's be real, we are going to do a incomprehensibly large amount of damage here. I mean, look at this. That is so many beams being funneled through our blue baby ripoff here. And, hello! Hush. Yes, that was... Uh, a lot of damage. A absolutely metric crap ton. This just, oh god, that looks so mental as it goes round. I still wish I had a way of knowing when my brimstone is charged, but I guess, you know, who needs that, right? We've just got the ultimate power of guessing. And everybody likes some guessing. That just looks so neat how it all focus. Okay, that one went a little bit mental, but generally how it all focuses into such a tiny little uh, narrow beam in the center where it tries its best to cut through the hush. This is probably going to hit me. Yes, it is, but that's fine. We've got ourselves the invincible and let's be honest, a lot of health to work with here, so we should be okay. I love it when the flies spawn because it just makes the brimstone go absolutely mental. I was about to say, oh, we actually got away with that, but no, we instantly got hit again. This is not the most skill taking of the hush in the world, but then again, when I'm in absolutely no danger of dying. Oh, that was some good positioning, though. I like that. Good night, hush. Sweet dreams. Sweet dreams. So a hush walks into a bar and the barman says, Ah! Oh my god, it's a monster! Oh, shit. I've not done the hush on this, on this save and then, and then this save. Bollocks! On a stick. Okay, every that was great damage there. All right, everyone, we return to the place where I once went, and this time, this time, this time, we are. You know, it's very lucky that there's two of them there. I was, I was about to be very upset again. <laughs> Didn't get transcendence this time. In fact, it was very, very different. Well, not very different. It was just, you know, a tiny amount different. So I didn't get transcendence. Obviously, we got Leviathan, so we're still flying. But I'm going to miss the the beard. It wasn't a mustache. It was a beard. Oh, I'm a moron. I don't even know the different types of hairs on a face. Uh, 
Oh, God. And this time, I also picked up Ouija board instead of pointlessly re-rolling it. And it's really cool, because it's made uh, the brimstone beams have different transparency, depending on how many are overlaying each other, while still keeping, obviously, the homing. So that's very cool. I'm glad we got to see both options. So the silver line is quite nice. Why did I, why did I bomb that when I'm literally, like the bomb destroyer. I, I just don't understand. So we are looking for a sloth. Has anybody seen a sloth? Now, it shouldn't be terribly difficult to catch a sloth. They're not the best at running away, if I'm honest with you. In fact, uh, who would win in a race between a sloth and a snail? Probably still the sloth, just because it's bigger, but they basically move about as fast as each other. Actually, no, I'd say the sloth's a little bit quicker. Alright, who would win a sloth-sized snail? snail versus a sloth, or a snail-sized sloth versus a snail? That's the question that we need to ask ourselves here. That is indeed the question. Da -da 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 -da. All right, puppy power! Everybody likes Scrappy-Doo, because he's the coolerist. Okay, two out of three on the guppy factor. Ain't too horrible. The guppy factor... Reroll! Hey, hey, yes! Oh, that's so good! Look at the brimstone beams! What a ridiculously good scene of the week! Oh, they look incredible! And I think they do actually look better with this transparency than the purple. Cause don't get me wrong, everyone likes classic homing purple. That would be like the name of the color. If there was like an Isaac interior designer and he was like, Oh darling, I would absolutely recommend a a single feature wall colored in homing purple here. It would just look simply mm, divine. Not to stereotype interior designers or anything. <laughs> Looks so good. I converted Isaac into a little bit of a heart. Aren't I just the best? I'm gonna go get uh, the uh, battery there because we need to re roll our chest items, yo. And there we have it. I feel bad for that first battery. It was about to be like, yes, I am the chosen one. Suck it, Steve. Steve, oh, he's, he's getting you. He stopped half an inch and now he's. Okay. That's. That's fine. That's absolutely. Absolutely fine. <laughs> okay. Let's have a look-see. And boom. And, and homing bombs. And uh, and milk. And tech X. So, re-roll! Oh, it happened! Yes! Do we want to... Oh, that looks so good! This happened in actual run with tech 1. Ah. Oh. Do we want to greenify it? I think we want to greenify it. We really do, right? Let's go full. Oh, no, still the Ouija board is king, apparently. I kind of do want to use the forget me now and get four more items. Let's do it. Let's do it. I mean, we might as well, right? We don't really need the D6 anymore there. And did we get anything good? Wow, we got Ipecac. That would actually just massively ramp the damage up, I think. I don't think it overwrites it. I mean, I guess we're about to find out. Yay! It's just a big-ass damage. Okay. What happened there was my brimstone didn't even get to damage it, I don't. Oh, no, it's because I don't have spider mod on this one because we didn't find that. That makes more sense now than I consider it. Hermit, where are we going? <laughs> I always get so lucky with random teleports on the chest. I really do. But, I mean, this one time, I'm not quite done destroying everything. Thank you very much, game. So, if you don't mind, I'm going to go annihilate a few more rooms. Got those blue zombies are so rare, but they're so useless. I just, I just don't see the point. We could actually get Cursed Eye. All it does is help with charge-based items anyway. Oh, this looks so, so sweet. It really, really does. Oh, my God. Got two rooms with them? That is ridiculously unheard of. Wow. I'm surprised my toxic thing isn't doing a lot more damage because I do have a lot of damage here. It's obviously based off of mine. We got a little bit of Zodiac action and pay to play. Pay to play is going to be absurdly powerful with uh, our current damage. Oh, look. I got to kill basic spiders with it. I am the best in the world. That poor bomb got denied. Ba -ba 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 
bum, 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 bum. And goodbye to you, Mega Fatty. God, we have so many ways of killing all the things. And then that's basically the expression those envies made when uh, they realized how much destruction was headed their ray. So that's kind of nice. Yes, headed to their ray. And boom. Wow, I can't even physically take damage there before it's too much. All right, then, Blue Baby. Prepare to get annihilated, for it is going to be glorious. What a ridiculous seed, though. And if you've got your own seed to submit, please do. Rage Isaac Rebirth at gmail.com is the seed to do it. Uh, tell me all the key items. Tell me where they are, what I need to do. Rerolling it, picking up the item first before rerolling it. What character? All the nitty gritty guide me through the run. Don't mention item names. There we go. One thing that the seed submitter of this did, which incurred that entire terrible rap segment, is, oh, that looked great, an entire document dedicated to describing it with a handy list of which the key items were, so I knew what up, you know, maybe think about that. RageAsRebirthJima.com, give me your seats. Like if you enjoyed this, subscribe for more, and I will see you next time. Oh, goodbye. You